What's going on? I'm Allison. For today's video, we're doing upper body strength focusing on shoulders and arms. If you haven't done it yet, make sure to tap the subscribe button and the bell to stay notified with the latest fitness videos released every Mondays and Thursdays. For this workout, you'll need a pair of light or moderate dumbbells and an adjustable bench. If you don't have a bench, that's okay. You can definitely use a chair instead or do these standing. For this pyramid style routine, we're gonna start with 20 seconds of work and then build up to 40 seconds, all the way up to a minute, and then work our way back down. You'll get a 20 second rest in between sets and a full minute rest in between blocks. This is a little bit more intense routine, so feel free to take longer breaks as you need to. A brief warm up and cool down is also included. So grab your equipment and let's get started. We're gonna do our warm up in a seated position. We'll do each move for 30 seconds on with a short 10 second rest in between. Kicking it off, we're doing some shoulder rolls. Sitting up nice and tall with the abs tight, take those shoulders up to the ears and roll them backwards. Halfway through time, we'll reverse the directions and go forward. exercise we're gonna open up the chest and shoulders and then round the shoulders bringing those hands together inhale open exhale bring it in warm-up move, extend those arms long and pump up and down. Second half of time, we'll make it a little bit bigger. For the next exercise, take a little bit wider stance with the legs and we're gonna alternate dipping one shoulder in, lift up, dipping the other shoulder. Move. Keep that same stance with the feet. Hands on the quads. We're going to do seated cat cows. We're going to inhale and then exhale. Pull the belly button to spine. Inhale, fly back forward. For that final warm up move, we're going to do some cactus arms. Bringing those arms up, inhale, exhale, pull those shoulder blades back, look at the ceiling, inhale, reach forward.
focusing on shoulders. Picking it up is a set of Arnold shoulder presses. Sitting up tall on your bench, we're gonna have our palms facing in, elbows tight, arms parallel to each other. Inhale, exhale, add that rotation, palms face away, full extension overhead, and then inhale, we bring it back in. Exhale, lift, inhale, lower. For the next move, we're doing alternating front and side raises. Now starting off with the side raise, palms are facing in, a slight bend in those elbows. We're gonna lift up till the arms are about parallel to the ground, lower down, and then keep the elbows soft, palms face down, lift up about shoulder level, and then lower. For that third move in block number one, I'm gonna go ahead and stand up for a set of upright rows. Having those feet about shoulder width apart, palms in, shoulders back, elbows soft. We're gonna lean with the elbows, lift the arms up, and then fully extend down, making sure not to lock up those elbows.
not good for each other bicep curls. Lie all the way down on your bench and let those arms just hang to the side. Now from here all we're going to do is curl up and then full extension down with the palms facing away. Like always feel free to modify this by doing alternating arms instead. For triceps we're going to do an upright row triceps extension. Palms are facing in, we're going to lift up for the upright row, extend those arms out and then bring it in keeping the upper arms parallel to the ground. For your final biceps move, we're doing a Zatman curl. For this move, palms face forward to start, we curl up, and then we rotate palms face down, lower those weights. Elbows are staying tight the entire time and make it a smooth transition.
you're so cold But we're always coming back for more Egos in this wicked game, it's all for sure Oh, I've got you If we figured out what it's all about Takes a second and then we back it up Feel as good. 
That strength routine. You did an awesome job. I'm sure your shoulders and arms are feeling really shaky right now. So let's go ahead and get a nice stretch. Staying seated on your bench or chair, let's go ahead and sit up nice and tall and do big shoulder circles backwards, up to the ears and down. We did this in the warm up, but now we're taking it nice and slow. Good. Probably feels a little bit different than it did when we started. Give me two more backwards. And then let's go forward, up to the ears and down. Keeping those fingers nice and loose. Deep breaths in and out. Definitely do these shoulders or do these um, stretches if you ever get tight or a little bit sore later on throughout the day or tomorrow. Good, shake it out. Let's take one arm across, pulling on the arm, not the elbow. A nice shoulder stretch. Holding for about 20, 30 seconds. Um, again, these are all depending on how you feel. So if you need to do them longer or hold the stretches longer than what I'm doing in this video, please do so. Remember to breathe through all the stretches. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Good, get one more breath in. And let it out. Let's switch arms. Other arm across. Again, pulling the arm, not the elbow, right towards the body. Feeling that nice stretch through the delts. Good job. Inhale, exhale, breathe. Give me two more breaths at your own pace. Nice job. And when you're ready, go ahead and release. You can shake up those arms. All right, tricep stretch. We're gonna pull on the arm, not the elbow, reaching towards the center of your back. So really depending on your flexibility, how far this is gonna go, but make sure it doesn't feel strenuous. You wanna make sure that it feels like a good stretch. 
good. Again, same breathing. Inhale and exhale out. Good. One more breath in and out here, and then we'll get the other side. Very nice. Bring it down, maybe shake it out really quick. And then when you're ready, bring that other arm up, reaching for the center of your back, pulling on the arm, not the elbow. Very nice. And just stay there. This is a great workout if you want to pair it with maybe like a lower body or a cardio day. Um, it's also awesome to do on its own. So if you're doing just a strength day today, this is definitely good enough too. <laughs> good, shake it out. All right, we're gonna interlock the fingers in front, round the upper back, inhale, reach, and then grab the wrist with one hand, reach over to one side, center up, reach the other way. Good, center up, bring it down. One more stretch for those biceps, pulling um, or gently pressing against the fingertips, straighten that arm, and then bring the fingertips back. You'll feel through the biceps and forearms. Good. And then we'll switch other side. We're gonna shorten up the time on this, but do two sets on each side. Good, shake it out. Do it again, first side. Beautiful, and switch. And release, go ahead and sit more on the edge of your bench or chair so you can interlock the fingers behind. Lift the heart and chest and give me a deep breath, inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Let's do that one more time. Inhale and exhale out. Release, interlock the fingers in front, round the upper back, dip the chin. Inhale, reach all the way to the ceiling and bring it down. You are all done for today. Great job. Great job at completing this workout. Remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel and also check out my Instagram at AlleyFitATL for more daily workouts.